with a wish your heart makes when you're fast asleep. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Magic Liriana, and today we are, or no, who's we? The royal we. I am going to show you guys my ear collection. So my ear collection basically consists of the classic headbands as well as, you know, the classic hats. So let's get right into the first video. pair of ears I'm going to show you was one that I got when I went to Epcot with my middle school. Every year we would take a trip to one of the theme parks in Orlando depending on like what grade we are we're in so like in sixth grade you would go to like any four of the Walt Disney World theme parks and then like seventh grade you go to Busch Gardens which is in Tampa eighth grade you go to Grad Venture which is at Universal Studios anyways so my first pair of ears that I got from going to Epcot that time were these these are my very first um headband ears that I've ever got or received um, these are cheetah print. They're very cute. They are basically like the old style of um, of Mickey ears, so they're kind of comfortable. But it, it looks like it's been through it's been through it. But I have washed this, so that's why it kind of looks wonky. I don't even know why it's like not even even. But this is what it would look like on me. They're still pretty cute. I would totally wear these to like Animal Kingdom or whatever. And this was back when ears were cheaper. This was like what fourteen dollars back then. Like that was a time, you know. But yeah, let's move on to the next pair of ears. These next ears are ones that I know you guys have probably seen me in a lot. And these are my Christmas ears. These are peppermint and they also have like the green bow. And I thought these were really cute. And it also says candy cane, yeah, candy cane cutie. And I actually got this off of eBay for $5 because the original owner was selling these for like like ten ten dollars or something and I also had like a five dollar off coupon so I got these pair of ears for five dollars and they were like in high demand in 2019 and I was able to get them like for my Christmas following to last year and I wore these during my Hollywood Studios trip and if you want you guys should totally check out that vlog um it's like four parts and i broke it up and edited it that way so i hope you guys check it out and you want to see me wear this i also wore this in my obviously a christmas vlog um that i went on you also should check that video out if you haven't already these ears are obviously perfect for christmas i just love the sequence of the ears and everything even though i didn't wear them when it was christmas at one point which was during my hollywood studios vlog from like last year um, it matched my sweater, so I was like, who cares if it's not Christmas? I just wanted to show these ears off. My next pair of ears are very cute. I think this is supposed to be or representing like how many used to dress in the earlier times of her cartoons. And it has her polka dots and then like the salmonish color pink for the bow. And then it has her little flower. And I actually got this at the Disney Character Warehouse. This is like basically where I'm getting my ears from now on because those things are like $30. And like I got this pair of ears for like $7.99 there. And honestly, it's honestly a very great deal. Um, I haven't worn them in a while, but I miss wearing these to the park. I think this is like my favorite pairs of ears that I have picked up so far and I'm glad that I have them. Okay guys, so this next pair of ears I actually forgot to show, but this is my Epcot ears and I got them recently in another video. If you guys haven't checked it out, it's where I went to the mall after the Disney Character Warehouse reopened after a few months. So please go check that out if you haven't already. And you can see that it has the Spaceship Earth like around the ears and then it has the bubblegum wall that you would see at the end of the ride which is really cute and I love taking pictures there and I can't wait to wear these at Epcot eventually whenever that is because I haven't been to the parks in like a while or since November and Spaceship Earth is like one of my favorite attractions at Walt Disney World so yeah anyways moving on to whatever however I'm going to fit this into the video but yeah my last headband ear is um a classic mini in her pink dress from like you know Mickey Mouse Clubhouse and my friend got this for me for my birthday and I appreciate it it's not an official um Disney Parks headband but it's still still a headband nonetheless and I would wear this sometimes too it's also Christmas themed because it has like the little oh I don't think it's like a mistletoe but it has like the cranberries and the leaves. I don't remember the name of this plant but um these ears are still pretty cute and I'm glad that my friend got this for me for my birthday a while back 
So the next part of my ear collection are the hats, you know, the little mouseketeer hats, and some of them are actually special, and then some of them aren't really, really like the hat, but it still has the mouse ears on it, and I wanted to show you guys. So the very first hat ears I have is a graduation cap, and it says class of 2019. I obviously got this after I graduated from high school not too long ago, or basically two years ago, which is crazy almost two years ago but like yeah it was like really a time and like it was got me really excited for college and I'm currently not there right now so big sad but hopefully I'll be able to attend or be back on campus in the fall maybe who knows and my hat also has my name embroidered on it and I thought that was a really nice element that I could be able to customize my hat so it's like a very special souvenir to me and I hope I have this hat for like a very long time the next hat I'm going to show you guys is Disneyland's 60th anniversary hat and honestly I never stepped foot inside of Disneyland in my entire existence so you're probably wondering how do I have this hat well you see the Disney character warehouse which I'll be talking about a lot now um, is basically the greatest place ever to get like awesome souvenirs even from like other parks um, this hat was like a dollar ninety nine I thought it was pretty cool that they had this there I was like really surprised actually that they were selling for like a dollar ninety nine and it has you know a Disneyland patch on it and it has Mickey in his diamond outfit if you can see it right there and it has the 60th logo on there and it says Disneyland Resort diamond celebration and I thought that was really cool and I'm actually glad that I got a piece of like Disneyland or stuff that has been at Disneyland without even stepping foot onto that property. My next hats, well yeah, are actually really tiny and really cute, but um, this is a goofy hat and with um, Mickey ears on it, and I like stole this from my little brother, but I'm gonna give it back to him. But I actually got it for him when I was attending my friend's school of Halloween event a few years ago. They were like handing out all these like hats and stuff because it was actually kind of hosted by Disney which is pretty cool and um this is the one that I actually own and it is of Donald with the mouse ears on him and I thought it was really cute I don't um I can actually wear these as like an actual hat but um I think I lost some of the accessories like the clip-on part where you can like put it on your head and wear it like one of those like bigger ear hats and then I also don't have like the little it also had like a thing where I could just stick it into my hair and I'd wear it that way. I mean, I'd rather have it out on display because it's kind of cute and I kind of don't want to mess it up so I kept it in the box all these years. I hope you guys enjoyed me showing you a bit of my ear collection. It's kind of small and I'm hoping to grow it a bit more especially now that I know I could get ears at the Disney Character Warehouse for like $7.99 and they're actually having sale where they're $3.99 now. So guys that is the end of my video. Please feel free to leave a like on my video so I know that you guys enjoy this kind of content. Please feel free to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my adventures. Make sure to hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on my adventures. And I will see you guys real soon.